You know, we talk about going from glory to glory, but I want you to think about this concept, the transformation of your self-perception. In the process of being and becoming more like Jesus, you and I partake of his nature through his indwelling spirit. And because of that, there's supposed to be within us a profound shift in how we perceive ourselves, or at least there needs to be if there isn't. You and I still wrestle with the presence of sin, but we've been redeemed from its power over our lives. doesn't mean we're sinless by any means. We still have to die daily in so many ways. What is important, though, both spiritually and psychologically, is that we acknowledge in our hearts and on our lips that a fundamental shift has taken place at the core of our being. We've been enlightened, we've been regenerated, and we've made a 180-degree turn called conversion. At our core, we're not who we used to be. We aren't an old person and a new person at the same time. When Paul talks about the old man, he's talking about who we were in Adam prior to being translated into the kingdom of the Father's beloved Son, the Lord Jesus. Who we are now as new creatures is in Christ. Sure, there continues to be a commingling of our brokenness and our beauty, but by the progressive work of grace, sanctifying us by the Spirit, we live and move and have our way of being in Christ. The way we observe reality now can change. The way we interpret reality now can change. The way we make meaning of reality now can change. Our emotions, feelings, and moods now can become spaces of possibility for change. Our body becomes quickened by the life of God because of the resurrection. As we move progressively from glory to glory in Christ, it's not a shift in how we used to live. It's a shift in how we participate in who we're becoming. We're now in union with Christ. We're one spirit with him. We participate in the very life of the Father and the Son by the Spirit. Beloved, ask God to help you grasp that reality, and you're going to have a more elevated sense of self-worth rooted in the grace that is making you everything you ever hoped you could ever be. Have a great weekend.